Today I'm reviewing the Seiko 5 SRPD55K. Today I'm going to be reviewing this watch and God, I love it so much. Mwah. It's such an amazing watch. I love it, honestly. Everything down to the case back, rotating bezel. I love everything about this watch. I've owned this watch for four weeks now. But the seriousness about it is that I've loved this watch even before I owned it. Well, before I seriously got into watch watches and horology, this was the first watch to catch my eye, ever. Obviously, apart from the Rolexes and stuff like that, but this was the first watch that really showed me that there's really nice affordable watches. Because before, I used to think that your watch has to have five digits in order to be a nice watch, in order to be built well or have prestige. But this watch definitely proved me wrong. This watch is called the Seiko 5, but what does 5 even mean? Well, that number actually has a reason, and it has a proper meaning. The 5 represents the 5 pillars of Seiko, which are water resistance, automatic movement, a day-date function, meaning that you can see the date and the date while wearing this watch on your wrist, and also a crown at 4 o'clock. Most Seikos have a crown at 4 o'clock. Don't ask me why, I do not know, but that's just how it is, man. Let's start off with its cons. Honestly, there's very few, but I can see where my ADHD self really nitpicks at what bothers me a lot. And that is its weight. It's really heavy. Like, honestly, it is a pretty hefty watch. Um, and that reminds me on Monday, uh, my friend picked up my watch and he said, ooh, this has a nice little weight to it, which means either a good thing or a bad thing, or uh, it feels very heavy, it's annoying, and if it weighs too little, that's a cheap piece of crap. That's enough negatives for once. Let's move on to the positives. Honestly, the looks of this watch, this, look, this looks amazing. The Seiko just, oh my gosh. Look at that, look at that case back. Just wow, just blows. And then not only that, you have you have an amazing rotating bezel. Let's hear it for a second. And let's just take some time to appreciate how amazing it sounds. But in all seriousness, this watch cost me around 230 on Amazon, 237 with taxes and stuff like that. But you could definitely find this watch way cheaper on the secondhand market on eBay and stuff like that, and, and any websites like that. You could definitely find this watch cheaper. One thing, one don't that I recommend do not do do not buy this at a department store, do not buy this at retail. Try to find your deals. I retail this watch nearly cost three hundred dollars I think 325 at Macy's please stay out of that do not buy it at that price point one thing I will complain about is the packaging I love a nice good packaging and the packaging for this Seiko is pretty lackluster if I'm being honest once you open this and you take out your Seiko 5 box I I don't know what type of like pattern that is you're greeted with your watch right there Seiko right which not bad but for MSRP is 300 so I would expect something a little better and this is the original Seiko 5 from from what 2013 where my other Seiko came from my $100 Seiko which I'm making a video about that one too you have look at this box this box is new it's such an experience. It feels very nice. It feels very premium. Very soft. You get greeted with this. You know. Nice little bag. You know. I actually prefer this a lot. Because like everything just feels more exciting when opening it. I have a video on my Instagram. When I opened it for my birthday. And it just felt amazing. Just opening a box like that. Even though it's only $100. But who cares? 
your watches are made to be worn you don't wear the boxes so that i mean i don't really care about that i i just enjoy i really enjoy opening a nice box so but that doesn't really bother me and you know what else doesn't bother me the loom because the loom is the loom is amazing i love i love the loom of this watch honestly when i'm at my nice stand right and i'm just admiring my watches this is the watch that speaks out to me the most this is the watch that makes me want to go to sleep with it because how like light the loom is i love the way how the loom is it's very eye-catching where i get it to dive watch so the loom well to dive watch so the loom has to be a very nice but the loom of this watch is very incredible i love it one very big improvement that i loved of this watch compared to my other seiko 5 manual wine so you could actually start up the watch like think of your watch as a um as a car so you could either wear it you know which you're moving the rotor or you could like jump start it and you know give it a few twists let's see if you can hear that you could charge it a little I said forget about it and it's still gonna last you 48 hours I mean that's not a lot but still that's very nice I like I, I love that I love that because I don't feel pressured to wear this watch I I wear it because I want to wear it but I don't feel pressured unlike that one I feel pressure like wearing it because I don't want it to die I just want to keep on wearing it and stuff so but with this I just wear it I could wear my moon swatch I could wear my Timex I could wear all these watches next day like good reliable good old faithful she's always gonna be there for you but that's what I love that's what I love well, I hope this video really helped you guys on making an informed buyer's choice when buying the Seiko 5. Like, honestly, this watch is amazing. I want to share this love with you guys. So, please stay on Horology.Company's Instagram. I will. Well, I have been posting a lot of pictures of this watch. And honestly, I love this watch.